This is my final video for tonight that I'm going to be in. Woman 40 attacks 18 year old girl after suspecting she had an affair with her husband. I believe this is the 18 year old girl. If I can get this to show up without Facebook getting in the way. Very pretty girl. Let's get on with the story. 40 year old woman attacked an 18 year old teenager after she tried to stab her with a broken beer bottle after suspect that the teenager had an affair with her husband. The 40 year old, oh dear lord, well she's Chinese. Chin, I cannot pronounce that, I'm just going to spell it out for you. I think it's like Ja Quinn or Jai Quinn. Anyway, X. I-A-Q-I-N was jailed for seven months in November on 28th Thursday for voluntarily causing to hurt a teenager with a dangerous weapon. The court said the 40-year-old is married to the director of a production company. The last, last year, May 10th, Ten, yeah, Chen went to hook on the Seaboat restaurant with G E Y L A N G with her husband and the employees to celebrate her birthday. The couple started quarreling, and Chen's husband left the restaurant. Then Chen stayed and drank some bottles of beer. Selena Yap, Y A P, the deputy um, public prosecutor, said at around 7 30 p.m., she approached the victim who was at the dinner party. Then she peeled her hair twice. She pulled her hair twice. This says peeled though. P I L L E D spells peeled, not pulled. She peeled her hair twice and used the beer bottle to hit the back of her head. Okay. It does say peeled, peeled her hair. You guys can find this. I'll tell you in a minute after I finish reading the damn thing. Uh. Upon the impact, the two women struggled with one another. Chen attempted to stab the victim with the broken bottle, but the teenager endured to block the attack with her forearm, but sustained the cut instead. Other um, colleagues at the party intervened to separate the pair. One person called the police, stating that the person was bleeding from the attack. The injured teenager was hurried to the hospital. The injuries of the forearm and the scalp was changed to scars from the incident in the court. Or, holy crap. I can't pronounce his name. But this is the defense lawyer. D-H-A-N-W-A-N-T. I believe that's the first name. Singh is the last name. S-I-N-G-H. Um, of Chen started that his client had behaved uncharacteristically on the moment due to fear and anger copulated with a distress of the adjustment disorder. Okay, whatever. The attack was spare of the moment and caused by her husband's subsequent conduct and actual dis departure from the scene, but not before making a sign language to endurment of the very female he was in tangled with an affair, he stated. Further, he said that the crime was an act to stop her husband from being stolen and to save her family from being apart. The lawyer added that the idea of her husband picking a company and another woman in a better scared of Chen. Goddamn. Goddamn, goddamn for intimately causing her to buy, be bah, hurt by the weapon of offense and expected to cause death. Chen could have been imprisoned for up to seven years or fined or canned or given any mixture of these punishments. But it don't show Chen. So Chen was pretty mad at Miss Yap. My God, man. My God. Yeah, this is why I, if you are being in a relationship, be honest with the person you're in the relationship with. If you're going to cheat, 
then you probably shouldn't be in relationships. That's just my personal opinion. If, if you're going to cheat or if you want to have fun, don't be in relationships. I mean, it, it's, it's safer that way for everyone. I'm James Williams. You just come for having number two. Be seeing you.